Welcome back, everybody, to Squirrel Hollow. Heading a few miles down the road uh, this afternoon. I'm going to drop my track off. Friends of the family had a great large uh, white oak taken down in their yard. So we can fire them. Sunday evening, I'm going to have the track loaded up. I'm going to drop it off at the house. Tomorrow, I'll uh, bring the dump trailer with me, and after work, I'll go by there and get a load. Probably get one tomorrow, anything. Some of us are uh, really too big to do the full width and all, so I'll probably just get the most of the smaller stuff. And, uh, hopefully, somebody else can use the big stuff. Hopefully, right now, it's going to be able to come back. Hopefully, uh, this is what is your mark. Uh, getting, the, getting the trailer loaded up and dumped off. It's uh, new lives. Not really the time you think you think about getting firewood. But you to get your hands on some free wood. It's all in the plus. One of pounds is it for you know it, so. no, no time is better than the present. <laughs> Everybody, we got a wood loaded up. We got a nice load of white oak uh, on the back of the trailer here. Uh, I, I don't know, probably about uh, if I had to guess, two and a half, three ton probably of uh, uh, firewood. Uh, heading on up to the uh, mom and dad's house and get that dropped off. Uh, that's their pretty much their sole source of heat in the wintertime. So uh, always on the lookout for some firewood and stuff to get. Uh, Get prepared for this winter. So we will uh, check back in a little bit um, as I'm dumping it off.
Well, I broke two chains on my dump trailer. That one. And broke this one yesterday. I broke the end off of it. Anybody got any ideas on this, what I can do with this tailgate? I can't get it to, to lay flat like a, like a truck bed tailgate. Um, there's about three different ways I can put the chains and I can't figure out how to make it lay flat um like like a tailgate on the truck it comes loose here to let down like that and it comes loose here like if you're spreading gravel or something um you can set the chains for that but the firewood it um dumping stuff like that it, the tailgate drops flat down and it ends up going into the ground putting pressure on it while it's dumping so any ideas on that did end up with a nice pile of wood though. That's uh, two dump trailer loads. Um, pretty much all cut up. Some of it's gonna need to be cut up a little, little bit more. But uh, hey, it was free.
got some scraps for the chickens. Looks like they're gonna have a nice meal tonight. Corn on the cob. I don't know what all is in here. Potato peelings, watermelon rind, rotten tomatoes. Yep, a little bit of everything. A little bit of everything. All the stuff that chickens like. I tried to when I came out the other night, any of the ones that were rotten, I tried to pull them off the vine. I gave several to the chickens. A busy evening we uh went by this evening and picked up my tractor that uh i had uh dropped off at the gentleman's house that was uh we was getting the firewood from so i went by and picked that up this afternoon got that back to my mom and dad's house and uh moved some firewood logs around there and just kind of getting ready for for firewood season there come home we eat a little supper and uh me and her come out and pick the uh few things at the garden we got quite a few cucumbers and some uh couple squash, a few tomatoes, uh, beginning to be a little too much uh, for us right now to fool with, so I put uh, put a few things down here by the road, two for a dollar. Anybody wants to stop by and grab them, you, know, you can have them for free. But uh, I got a little sign out here where uh, we sell the eggs and stuff down here by the road too, so it's something fun to do, you know, if we make a couple dollars, that's good. If not, you know, we ain't worried about that either. But. Getting ready to go in here now, it's about 8 o'clock. We're getting to see what the president's got to say, see what kind of lies he's going to tell. And um, anyway, that's going to wrap it up for this video. And we'll hope to see you all on the next one. Talk to you later.